Noon at 11 o'clock, we are two days out from North Carolina's new executive order going into effect. Businesses like gyms, amusement parks, restaurants, wineries, breweries, and pools will be able to open at 75% indoor capacity and 100% outdoors. Tonight, we're talking with some restaurants having a hard time, they say, hiring back a full staff. Our Brandon Hamilton is live, and Brandon, uh, finally, they get to reopen for larger crowds, but are rest restaurants really ready for the increase? Well, Molly, the short answer is yes, but there is concern as more people are expected to sit in these seats at the table. So that is good news, more business. The bad news, they're struggling to find the staff. Inside Queen City Craft and Gourmet, you'll find what you expect at any restaurant. The food, the customers. But what you may not notice at first is how many positions need to be filled running with less servers, less hosts, um, no bus boys, no dishwasher, uh, you know, only a handful of cooks. And uh, but we're we're doing everything we can to get through it. Charles and Kat Reed owned the restaurant in the South Charlotte area. Pre pandemic, they had 24 employees. That number today, 14. We're needing we need more staff and it's, it's really hard to just to get people to apply. Um, more than anything. A lack of applications, and when you add COVID-19 to it, a magnifying glass on an issue they say has always been a problem in the hospitality industry. Amazing how few applications we get. Um, you know, we've, we've found some really good employees during this pandemic, but we haven't gotten the, nearly the number of applications that we usually get. Um, I'd say it's been a tenth of the applications. On Friday, a capacity increased to 75% indoors and 100% outdoors with social distancing. Definitely a concern. It, it always is a concern. Uh, it's more difficult now during the pandemic, but as business owners, um, we fill the gaps. My wife here uh, bakes all our bread and everything, so she comes in early in the morning. With each pour and customer through the door, they're thanking the community for the support and patience. It's been the toughest year. It's something I never, you know, I thought of every scenario of everything that could happen to the business. And of course, this was not at all in the playing field. Now for you at home, if you are looking for a job, the advice from the Reeds is to reach out to your family owned restaurant in your own neighborhood. They save restaurants all across the board need your help. Reporting live in South Charlotte, Brandon Hamilton, WBTV on your side. You look very comfortable. Brandon looks like a great spot. Thank you.